Waka kukachiko ka parlamenti, akavna nziwa kusonga zo wa president mu parlamenti. Akama nyiduanga ka committee on presidential affairs. Kapita demu ingato, okuole kerech tezi, okuangiro kunga nyebiro ozo biyabantu, abako sewa kasasiro, nebiba afirua. Banonga bakule mbedua musentebe waka chiko, Alex Biargaba. Haba tuze wa sose kubalo mbojida na kujiba itamu, okusula muwema kate miezebidi. bidi. Batu menyanga tewaiseo na dachika eri yao e yamanyi. Ida tuwa vamo mnyumba nga tituina chituesi. Chituesi vye, metufuruma, tutase, abakola, okusogolo kujayo banafe. Na yeka akano mkampu muno tuwa kamala o inaku, zigenda mkaga. Boli naku, tuweba kao, tetuchakola. Tuwa gala kufawa no, tukoyo edi suvizo vyo tusuviza, olina jana asuviza, olina jana asuviza. Tuvikoye, tukoye vyo na, tuwa gala kufawa no. Mungkambi eno, mulimu abantu ababuru waka ababwe, nga bacha waga midi mkasasiro, ila katiba genda baguwa mwesobi. Edi okufune milambo jabantu ababwe, nga wachiri, bagala watekebwewe chijukizo. Bale wika bako yeo, atenge mbera, uh, urusi, wakaru vidi zaamu katono. Na ife chafe chiba decha kubawa e subi, nti government eba laba, eba manyi, eba agara, Ate eleba rumirwa. Bano, eleba lazeno kutia kubali norwebi itingana. Mubagenda kubawa sente, bagende bapangise, chebagamba ndisicha wenkanya, nandada kubantu, abali na mayumba gabwe. Haba tuze babu ulida babaka, tibagala kulaba president seveni yenyini, gubaba gonjola na yebi ya chitezi. Ubayari zeku wano, tusabu umukuru, ngabwe mukambie nti mwe, muinzo umutule etela ya rabbi, Allah tusasile, umutule etela ya rabbi, Allah tusasile, umutule Habe chitezi, beu unya mseveni, okubasi ndikira angaba waka, wabula nale mokuwe stukira, okula mbule chifechiri ranya chivuga kampala. Wabu wamu gamanti ya kuwari ya chitezi mwari mwari kola, mwule kata ambule la ya jala, e, mbela jetu itamu. Sentebe waka chiko, ero mbaka wa isi njiro south, haba tegeze za, ngo kusaba kwa we, wabagendo kutu usewa president, mwangu dala. E chukuru mwewe vyo na, kugumikiriza. Kubanga, government, eba manji, eba agala, ele genda kubayamu. Haka chiko kano, kasubi roku sinka no mkule mezewe guanga mwangu, no kuwa ya lipota mparlamenti kusonga ye chitezi. E Saliruwa magezi, agenko merede. Shamim na wakoza. Wabali kumanti oliku salam tv chanyizo kugamanti ye mbele liye chitezi. Nze bintu vye chitezi vyo. Buduwe mbitu nuri la olabi da dalanti e chokola wechiri. Waluo maso seno, atuseno kugamanti tukoye visu vizu. Ni hati na fabala ba tukoye ukulaba. Aba genda yu. Buli ya genda ya genda kuchime yu alipoda. Banoba ziba chime alipoda. IGG ya soka na chime alipoda. Banuba chime report. Kesi si ya genda. Neba minister bagala yawe. Ne, ne ba, ba, ba MP bagala yawe. Kwa gamba chitezi ya fuse ya kusomera kwa busomezi. Na chaba tawo temba ya amba. Eh? Buli ya avayo na ganti kati ya, ya njentu wala yesemba yu. Kesi si ya kula reporta. Ya jitu wala mkachi kwa parliament. Ochibulira. Akachi kwa parliament. Nze mbaba mainti baba tutemu parliament. Katarine parliament na yeja, baba kana obaja. Na baba kala kukula alipote ya abwe. Kakati na ijiji, na ya kule iye. Ya tuka no gobya executive director. Ni haba ntubote wa feed duwako. Ni ema nyanti buli ya jao nti ngeda kukula alipota. Buli ya jao wako yisa senti. Teleza mui wa musuru. Kakati situmanyi, tutugambani. Kwa buli kwe munga nti yamba baba ntubi mbo mchitezi. Nga sindi kayo timu. Bloga nti bane ya bantu weta wakuyambiwa. Nga timu egenda. Timu ezi genda. Ezi dati tuzidaba. Na ika negate kuhoye omuchala um, um, abadawe ichitezi. Nga ganti fetu kuhoye tusu ubiza. He? Banga nudi onaba ntu wabutipa inachibala ba. Baba subiza subiza. Abadu kilide kamele. Abadu kilida. Kakati ya abana. Bagi ndo kuhumula. Abana bagi ndo kuhumula. Abana bako mawu. Ya kati ya abana bako mawo mulu 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 wamfu. Ilaba sanga o muka ugote kako. Ochilaba. Bana abana bagena kusomiru bagena. Nibada 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 nibada
banangi wabelewe chikolebwa kusobola kuyamba abantu abo abechitezi wabelewe chikolebwa echenkizo njao kweba za okwera nti oli ku salam tv amanyanze twa mchibi olunako rwali tugenda genda ne era tugenda kupera nga tutunulia bintu bya kccca bintu bya chitezi bintu bya ngudo e bintu bya nchiko obutabangu ko buli mu kitebe echa kccca obukulembeze obulabikante bwina je budda ate bale sobo pya buno buganyi ni bale tawo bupya kati chiche china akola enso byevawa etuja kwa yetocho na ko rwali tusobola kwera nti tutegera echigenda maso webale kwera nti olina fe ku salam tv a uh, nanabiye minister wa Kampala ne yafurumiza ibintu uh, byagabide abantu banamukadde abasusize emyaka government we vayo ko bweti ne yamba ne dukirira abantu abasusize emyaka kiba kirunyi ne wateko kubera we chikolebwa echenkizo okusoba okudukirira abantu banu twagati oba bazimbi bwe nyumba oba kumi bwa abamu tibaina buyambi otugena tunulira mu kadde mbutufu nga taina buyambi taina mwana mudukirira ne government yandi badde mudduki anga ne ye ni batandi kawo ganti afuna yo akasenda akasenda ogeno katunamu ndio mwaka afuno be mitwali ibiri obe kuga ezita sobala na kuinagula because sebwe bisoka kakati wabedewe chikolebwa echenkizo okusobola kuddukirira abantu banaulira sime omwaka bafuna mitwali ba musa Uwe mika. Bizubi ya kutegera. Nebo chifuna au no chitunurila. Uwe kulanga chiku nyiza bunyiza no chivako. Watiku kupela we chikolebua. Norecho nabie minister Kampala. Nga jaguza. Abantu wano unakuru wabwe. Mokampala njaga usoko tunurie bifana ibino. nga tuze okumanya bizibu bya basanga nga abakadde era okulaba engeri chi yeba kuna musende za za chi za government government ya take out policy ezenja ulo abantu bali no kuita okweja mbwavu omuli parish modo mbarish modo muli musente zo mulema zo abantu abata abali no bulemu then embera yo ne sente eza abakadde eyo ministry agenda waliyo sente za abakadde eza elderly then no better on is our PWD. So my writing teziwe wa katuzo kulaba katuta ni kidemu kampala or tutaba or rafe na to gena gena to rutam zeranga buli abaka deba nangi mbagambi mugen de baba janjabe baba kebere pressure baba kebere sukai nendwa dendala zona ezomu kawago na bulichim inangena kola medical camp wano nyongero kuba janjaba ngom sawo mutendeke solo kuba janjaba ku mba kebere kare mugeti o ina pressure berenga jack fune dagara Nenga at least take a date kino che chimuluma oba yenga ate kamba tyo gendo kusimba line bato okujja mala lilonga gafe ne kati ngenda chikole cho kulwange ne tuwa na basaba bakebere abekebeje sobolo kulaba erenzi na koko langenda kubanga nkola medical camp one eh bato nulire ebintu ebyo mnange abe bachusiza miyaka gamundi abadege za ko kubera anti ebaddo kirira ere e a Uli afuna chilo ya sukari ingabu hizi tiyo chilo za zo mchede Na ukuta andikira ko Kakati minister njaga umotegeza ya sindi saba kadavu Bia muku betu gama antipane government ita, ita saba antu wabu Wakani mugeni baba kebidi Mugeni baba kebidi Ni haba kadavu tipa ina special uh, Tipa ina special status je baba wa maruari Baba gena yu basa sura sente zao Kati umuka deku miyaki insamfu Yandi wa dage na mudua lilo Na sanga ya kasente Nga wa agenda Ovoli yao Bamu kebedida buwiri Ni mamu uubu janja wiku buwiri Ya kakati Minister wabasi ni seni emu na ijima gendo Lusi tiba ina na senti habu Wabawadama gezi ne tiba ina senti Mchiteke mga government Usupro kwela niti bantu wa nambaduki Miaka chinana Bage na mudua lilo Asangeyo ebimu hizo muyambanga Tasa sudeka senti Wabu mtipa inaba anaba inza kupina nti baba yamba. Wabu la njaga la buemvao nkulage e njega ilabika nti ya gude ilia batambula. Awadu batambulia kuliato mugwange ilia DRC chagenzo kutegele kika nti abantu wenjoke ya katinduza balinga chenda. 
kwa muendo kwa genze gulinya. Ababa deba tambuli ya kuliato, e DRC, dia genze neri ingida, ila obeta video buta ambula bula ka, ngali kampola, mpola, 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 neri kilida, mpola, ogeno kakana, ngali onali gwele deo mazi. Abaso bodo kuona baawonye, ni yaba singo obunji, baanji baafude. Amaudi kituwa de tufunagaba de galaga, okuso kedela, nti abantu wa baafude, baba de makumi atano. Ni babo unge hafu ni bayo gira kuunkaga. Uh, bayo gira kuunsambu mwa batano. Nsambu mwunana. Kati wewekede unako uruwa lero. Bayo gira kubantu chenda. Aba fili de muliate de liyaba de kulekivu. Lekivu esangibwa eri mu Eastern DRC. Nolecha abantu wa baba de batambla. Tuwa gara kusasi laba familia za abwe. Eri ato limu. Baba chidi eri. Zaba chida chidi eri. Echidi yeri echo, bonuri yifana nyebio. Chaba deko abantu, bibidi, monsamvu, monmonana, bonanga batambu yoku. Bibidi, monsamvu, monmonana, batambu yoku chidi yeri echo. Ugeno kakana, ngachikiri de mumazi. Ira abantu, abalabi kanti ya mirambo, jika kasa. Okubira antiba, naba kulabi kako. Wetoke unakuruwa lero, bali mchenda. Nocho jaga ukubo muna angeli haba antu haba tambuli ya kumazi mwe. Na, ukubo ila ne jaketi. Ezi inzo baya ambako kukubula mu. Jaketi ezo zibira u. Jaketi ya inzo kuya ambako. Okuku umira wa guru kumazi. Singaba kule ingira. Singaba ila obu yambi obu ja. Buku sango li kumazi kuunguru. Ozo kupata sopula kuuga. Ne jaketi sopula kuku umira wa guru. Uzo kupata sopula kukula kutia. Ne jaketi e kuya ambako. Omutono kukumi na waguru. Nolecho. Mwino kubela ntipu. Obela ngo genda kuli ato ngalino. E jaketi yo weba tedi yo. Bagayi ni nja gindi ncha. E jaketi yo. Nebobo manyo kuka kati banu baba de mnyanja wakati. Bada fawafe kampala ni mgenda ikalangala. Uhino kula ntipu. E, e, e jaketi yo weli. Ufuta sopula kubela ntipu. Ofa mungeri eta inza kuyambi wako. Ntibobela ne jacket. E kuyamba kwenye kumi lao. Mungeri yemu. Juki nti unako uruwa jo. Binawe vya afurumide. Baba deo jo. Ni ato kwa osa jo. Eda mawuri dama uli de wano. Nti e Nigeria. Na yoba afude. Bafachi. Eda baba de kuli ato. Abato ba afude. Basu kama kumi abili. Na uba badeba tamuli ya kuli atu. Nini tuka wili atu use. Nini tani koko kiri ya mpola mpola. Baga antili ya food day engine. Nibageza ako li tereza. Nibigano ne, geno kakana. Excuse me. E, geno kakana. Nganario li kse momazi. E, na, e, baba deba li ku uh, muga guba itanija. Mu Nigeria. Na uba food day. Ukosa jo. Kakati na bonga bata ambula Kakati ate jo Banu baba deku Baba deba na baba, baba de diara singa bata ambula Chenda Bafu Baka sibo kwa yanti bafu Chenda Ote kila wimi mungu kila bulu unji nyowa no Elia telia waneo Elia templa Elia taba antu mu Uganda Nolicho na fetu ino kwa yanti wege Ndeleza haba tambu ya kuleku Victoria Kwa yanti mutu nulira Amazago sima angu. Nihibu di wembe langa muli nja kupo muli angi liba nafe. Bichikuwa atako. Ababa ilanti. Iba kubelelebi ya intambula ze ili ato kubelelanti. Bata asaba antu. Abantu wa taina. Boba anga omutu wa taya ambadi. Tomu kili za liato kufawo. Tomu kili za chidieli kufawo. E chidieli. Chitu wakaba antu wa suke chikumi. E bibizi. Norecho. Abantu wangu tibani na vau. Kwa chobo chika, chona chika rumu. Kutemplo juki ya buru unji nyonti. Waduwa abantu wangu avari ba wana u. Bebao yod. Bebao yigeza ako okuga. Neba sembira wali yeriate ya didi zoku ya amba. Beli ya didi simbulo kufau. Naba ni wali yei wako kakanangali efude. Beli efula. No mtu yali avuze yeriate. Chambinyo. Chakabi, 
E yali avuze liyato okujo kuyamba ya vakuru karu. Okujo kuyamba. Believu nika ya soko kufa. Biliari wano. Norecho kati. Bili DRC. Bili di Nigeria. Tuteko kusabe nyo. Abantu wa fe. Norecho biwobe binyini bie bichari. E Nigeria. Uh, bacha ageza okuno nye mirambo. Kati na kusatu. E DRC ba anonye za e guro. Nebuziba. Na kati bacha anonya. Tuino kwege ndezo kulanti. Abantu wa fe. Abatambia kumazi. Bali safe. Nyo. E bila bie nalabie. Na kuzino wano wa story jempu lida. E ya abasajja. Abava mu UCC. Abafela. Uh, Chache mu. Nibaji fedela nudala. Yaba ganti sente zisu kaka umbi. Baba kuza TV, baba kuza TV, TV weli, TV weli. Ugele kakadanga basa sude. Omukuruwe kanisa asa sude. Baba ama na nebe yongela. Nena udidenti polisi e ina biafu, biafu nyeko. Tuja kusaba eba nyuele ze dala. Jona gami nti e, e ya polisi. Waguru China Hospital. E nakawo jiraba wetu nudawe take yo. Dari kwa polisi. Dari kama yumba ga polisi. Hawa ni wago wawaba. Ntuweba. Tano ni nubela duwa manji. Nyoti ya gas. Bichi bichi bichi. Bale medemu. Haba ntuunga. Baba jamu. Ogeno kakananga. Baba jamu. Kati ensiko yeba dao. Boba tunatuka uka ampalache nyizo kugamba gwe. Alie dida. Di ensiko joba dola ba. E nakawa. Saidi ya wabasi bawe chibati. Ni mama ni wachijawo. Wenjo kere unako uruware. Uboli mkungu wa government. Katuna chitegira. Kati etake rodeo na bali trakita zezi yombi lao. Ziteka o church. Ilabi kanti nene nyo. Fenero. Ilabi gena masu. Noko ilanti. Itakari hafu seri ya church. Norecho. Bichuku hata kono za mwani zene mtu nyonyura. Ne mtu buli. Ilabi avaliti ya mwani. Ne mtu keno. Ne tuja kuite gira mpula mpula. Chituna tega chituna babuli ya. Ne chituna tega babuli ya ukati. Kuchoku ilanti. Uh, Checho kubira nti etaka wetu ogele da Church iti wa fenedo Egena maso no kusenda no kuteleza Una una Sipolo kubira nti yi wawawa antubayo Bagene maso no kusaba Ebyo bie tuinzo kuogela Njaga tukene tumre muka tono na kuruwa lero Programo mkeze tukene kubira nga tutambula Mpola 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 Nenga tunulida emivuyo ejiri mochitongo Lecha kesi siye Na baba chimanyi Aba chitegira Okubira nti batu nyonyola Echitongo lechine umivu yojiva wa jita andikila wa ila jira gawa. Nze tuwa hamchibi. Atuwe nitu mwule mkatono. Tuke na kwele anga tukoma uogwe. Atuwa basa agaro vile niti wafaku salam tv. Explore, enjoy, and dance to the latest content, beats, and kawozi from Uganda and beyond. Simply go to your Play Store or App Store right now, find Afri Mobile, download it straight to your phone, and get started. Is it TV you want? Simply open the app, click on TV, select the channel you want, and watch live. Are you busy right now? Then check out On Demand or enjoy in your free time. Afro Mobile. The future is now. My friend, just enter. Everyone now has all access to Pearl Magic Prime. Kasim, give this man some biscuits. They are over. They are over. But, relax. Here is where you get to enjoy all the premium local entertainment. <laughs> you see these people here? They are on DSTV access, like you. But now they can watch big shows like Sanyu, then they fall in love. Or they can watch Beloved and they cry. Do you like crying? You look like you like crying. They have brought more biscuits. You see, this is your home of entertainment. Randy Road, 
kugera wona atukedde ya konkona okakasa eh Tusawu kubera mutuka duka Wachi te tugenda mo Info Trust Property eh, Consultancy eh. Ne tutandi kampola ampola Info Trust Property Consultancy Bali ne taka kungu dozo na Nebi buga vyo na Enanga poloti zawe Zitandi kila kumilioni satu na chitundu e, Zitandi za chapa Songa teze chapa Zitandi kila kumilioni kumina bili e, Raba kiliza nengola e, Yachiba anja ampola Info Trust Basangi waka mocha Kila lodi Poloti china na musambu Nga waka vakulubis petrol station e, Simu Noti musambu noti mwenda Chenda monana Kumina mwenda Asatu musambu Oba Zero musambu musambu nya Asatu mobili, abili mosatu, noti tano. Info trusty for the humble beginners. I have a list of suspects in my file here, but I need you to help me identify the thief who attacked you. This can thief again. Malaria is a thief. Don't let it rob you and your loved ones. Prevent it by sleeping under a mosquito net. Clear bushes and all stagnant water around you. If you notice any symptoms, go to a health center near you to test and treat and ensure to complete your full dose to avoid severe malaria which could lead to death. This message is brought to you by... Quality of your sleep can make or break your day. We charging a Neuroform mattress and wake up recharged every morning. Euroform. Sleep better. Uganda, the heart of Africa, where tradition thrives alongside strength and perseverance. A country that cherishes every taste of life. We adore our food and we leave for the festivities. For 62 years, we have transformed challenges into victories, unified by a shared vision. Join us in reflecting on Uganda's remarkable 62-year journey of independence. Tune in for extensive coverage and special programs on all our platforms. Partner with us to celebrate Uganda's story. For more information, call 0200 330 222 UG at 62. Where does it come from? That thing that makes us Ugandan. Some say it's in our history, in our culture, and in our hearts. In our warm smiles and vast miles of coffee. It's in our inherent pursuit to always be better, to never stop growing and glowing. We are a nation of sweat and skills, a nation of ideas and inventions. But what truly makes us Ugandan is our quest to invest in agro-business, manufacturing, tourism, infrastructure, health and education to improve the quality of life of Ugandans. That's what makes us Uganda Development Bank. Uganda Development Bank, inspiring development. Waluo Mwami, Allah Tabarak wa Ta'ala ya mugeze sanga talina maguru wabata ambla yekula wekuluzi. Wasajja bamu sanga ni bamu ewu nyanga alimu kutendele za katonda no kumweba zanti alhamdulillah Allah biwampa binji. Kwe kumubu zanti wichimu kama katonda biya kuwa kwe. Nga tula batu wandi badembeba za mkama katonda. Nadamu na ganti katonda yampa bini wa mange. Chisoka, yampa ulimi yorumu ogerako. Nage choku vili, yampa omutima ogumweba za. Okweba zo kwa nina madala. Atena yampa no omutima ogusima evyo vya yampa. Oru gando mulunji alieyo. Uchimanyi ntivye tuini okweba za mkama katonda vinji. Luwashi, tofa yonyo kulaba anti tewe kubagiza kubanga bia kuwa debi itirifu. Tolaba watu gamba mkuruani. Nga agamba anze, agamba gwe, agamba nabi Muhammad sallallahu alayhi wa sallam. Na mga anti maa wa daa karabuka wa maa kala. Umurunji ya liyeyo, muka makatunda takwela vide ya dokusu lila. Takwela vide katunda kujukile la kumanyi. Ela kuliko nyo, mwebe ya tujukiza, disembeze, ibirozo ya fenemio ya jaferi kumanyi anti katunda atuliko. Ya gama anti alami ya jidi kayatima ni faawa. Uwango umurunji. Mukama katunda tia kujia mumbere yobwa mulekwa na akuola 
nakuza na kutusa kudalo na kuruwa lero lorimu. Banji mufe tuwazari wanga tuina bakade. Abala nentuzari wanga bakade bafewe wali. Na ye mbeira yobula mubewali batu wanga alizamu. Orwebi enfuna biya webambi biya biya bifunda. Tuwa wanga alanga tulinga ba mulekua. Nuku agalo kusinga kuba mulekua mbeira mkama katonda jia tuwa wanga alizamu. Naba ntuwa waji ya bawa. Echoku bili ya gamba. Wawajada kadhala nfahada. Saa kusinka nanga wabula. Saa kusinka nanga. Ebiye dini tobili yiko fahada ni mkulungamia. Toma yitu wali ya chisera nga tosara. Ngotoju kila ya chisera. Nga guwa kubiliza wa ntogenda mintu ebi obu jemu. Nebi, nebi, nebi menya wo. O mpise nunji mwusi. Na ere ronga guwa kulembe do kubiliza wa ntu. Banda nge mgeende msale. Tuweyo. Tuyamba wa ntu. Tuweyi sebulunji. Allah ya ntifahada. Sia ya kulungamia. Walwe chobu gage chisingo muntu katonda guwa wadobu lungamu. Gwetola bantu katonda wuku wade. Wachi we kubagiza. Echo kusatu ya gamba. Wawajada ka ailan faagna. Na kusisi inkano li muavulu nkupe. Ne kusitula mubie mfuna no gagawala. Banda anga balunji. Katonda ya tusisi inkana. Chari kechisera anga tulibavu badembe. Nge mundu zivu gechilo ne misana. Laila wanahari echo kulie chuno nyambisere vye ntalo nga techira wika. Fa agna na tukagawaza ni dembe. Mukama katonda ganti wobo kakasa anti ebi onze ya biko lila uluwele velie. Kakasa anti nebi nebi kutele ronja biku jira o. Ebanga liona amalanga weba ziza. Ebanga liona amalange vye ngele vye vye nkuwa do vye ogera kere vye jukira. Oja kufuno bugumi nkilizo tuke kubirunji. Vye ogendo kwenye mirizamu. Olunako uluencha. Wachu weja mbude. Wachu omutu ya ndiye kumieko. Omulilo ne ira mafuta ne familie ye jembudu uluwachi no bachiri. Tubele nobu gumi nkiliza, tubele ne sobi mkatonda, katonda wa fatu wagala, haba kubanga tatu wagala, tutuandi badeonga tulivalamu. Salamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuhu. In the 82nd ayah of Surah Al-An'am, Allah Azza wa Jal tells us something Ibrahim alayhi salam said to the people, فَأَيُّ الْفَرِيقَيْنِ أَحَقُّ بِالْأَمْنِ In Kuntum Ta'alamun in the previous ayah, which of the two groups do you think deserves peace more, internal peace more? And so this ayah is about people who attain peace in their life. You know, people suffer from all kinds of emotional imbalances, depression, sadness, uh, anger, anxiety, you know. How do you attain peace? And is there a relationship between faith and peace, internal peace, even emotional, psychological states of peace? Allah says, الَّذِينَ آمَنُوا وَلَمْ يَلْبَسُوا إِمَانَهُمْ بِظُلْمٍ Those who truly came to believe and did not disguise their truth or their, their faith with wrongdoing. In other words, wrongdoing is a disturbance in your, not just on the outside. When you do dhulm, you're disturbing something on the outside or someone on the outside. But in this ayah, beautifully, it is as though Allah is describing that when you do wrong to someone else, you've actually disturbed something inside of you. And then Allah says, if you're able to not do that and not wrong others and not do wrong, you know, not do injustice of any kind, أُولَٰئِكَ لَهُمُ amn. Those are the people that deserve peace. They'll have peace. They'll have peace inside of themselves. SubhanAllah. You know how many times we see nowadays that soldiers that come from war that have witnessed atrocities or in settings where there were no oversight committed atrocities or were silent witnesses to atrocities that their brethren committed in, you know, during wars, they come back and commit suicide or they have nightmares or they're not able to have relationships or they can't go to sleep or they're all on kinds of medications, you know, PTSD and you name it. Not just from physical trauma. Physical trauma is something else, but just from the emotional trauma of what they've experienced or what they may have even had to do or they did and got away with. Well, they, they got away with it in the, in, sen in the sense of the authorities and the government and all of that, but their insides have been damaged. They don't have any peace anymore and they can't live with that. There are people who commit any, any and all kinds of crimes, not just against other human beings, but people like, you know, for example, nowadays, subhanAllah, there are people that are in the entertainment industry, they're in the music industry, they're, you know, and maybe they're not even the top celebrities, but people that are, that are in a particular kind of industry that has to do with just sinning and just wrongdoing. You know, they're in the clubbing industry. They're in this, one of these dirty industries. These people have to literally stay on drugs to be at peace because they're just, they're terrible to themselves and others when they're not in that state. They have to literally numb themselves away from reality to be able to cope, just to be able to cope, just to be able to deal, subhanAllah. Allah says, people who were truly have found faith, they found something they could not find in a club, they could not find it at a party, they could not find it in a drug, they couldn't find it in alcohol, they couldn't find that peace anywhere. 
You know, and for those of you that aren't into these terrible things, maybe you're just into entertainment. You're just watching movie after movie after movie after movie after movie. And it's just messing you up on the inside. It's just tearing you apart. And the only thing you can do is fill that empty space with more entertainment and more entertainment and more entertainment. It just doesn't stop. And one day you just decide, and Alhamdulillah Ramadan has come, so you decide to cut it, right? At least cut it down. Hopefully you cut it all together in this month. And then you go to the masjid and you feel this peace. And you haven't felt it in a long time. So you can tell the difference between the toxic waste you've been putting inside of you, spiritual toxic waste, and now this cleansing, just the listening to the Qur'an, just putting your head on the ground with everybody else. Just those few minutes even, what that does to you. You know, at the beginning, when, you're, when you've been eating terrible food for a long time, healthy food tastes bad. So in the beginning, when people come after a long time to a masjid, they're like, I gotta get out of here quick. Is there a moving plane nearby? Can I do, do that instead? You see a lot of people, young people especially, want to hang out outside the masjid. You know, they're, and they're all on their devices. Nobody's at peace. Nobody's just sitting calmly. You know? This is what iman does. It gives you calm. It gives you peace. You're not jittery. You're not disturbed. You're not just constantly in the need for some other fix, you know, whether, whether for your eyes or for your, you know, for your brain, for your tongue, you know, for your, for your limbs. You're not looking for that fix. You're just at rest, subhanAllah. أُولَٰئِكَ لَهُمُ الْأَمْنِ وَهُمْ مُحْتَدُونَ And they're the ones that are committed to guidance. In other words, Allah is saying that this without commitment, you're not, you're, it's only going to come and it's going to go. You're going to have to show some commitment to be able to hold on to that peace. Allah Azza wa Jal in another place in the Quran, He says, Allah bi dhikri Allahi tatma inna al qulub. You should know that by remembering Allah, hearts become calm, they become tranquil, they become at ease. And that's what this ayah is about. Wallahi, the world, every human being on this world, on this earth, is looking for peace. They're looking for tranquility inside of them. Something is bothering them, and they just say to themselves, you know, you tell yourself, if I just had that, I'd be happy. And they put it in different words, I mean, being happy. If I just had this, if I had this much money, I'd be happy. If I got this girl, I'd be happy. If I had this car, I'd be happy. If I had this house, I'd be happy. If I lived here, I'd be happy. If I bought that device, if I had that video game, if I did this, if I did that. We always set these goals and say, I would be happy. And guess what? The ones you set for yourselves before and you said, you'll get there and you'll be happy, how long did it last? And then you moved on to something else that you, you couldn't find satisfaction in. This is the ayah that Allah Azza wa Jal teaches us it, through the words of Ibrahim Ali, some timeless words, right? If it was true back in the day, it's still true today. SubhanAllah. The people who can truly find faith and they don't replace their faith with wrongdoing. So even if you're Muslim, doesn't mean you have peace. Maybe you're replacing your faith with wrongdoing. You need to stop doing the wrong, cut that out of your life, and Allah will grant you the gift of peace. May Allah make us all the people of peace, and may Allah all make us all among al muhtadin Allah created the human being with the knowledge of Himself. The human being knew already there is this highest ideal, Allah Azza wa Jal. And not just that there is a God and He created us and now we can do whatever we want. No, He's the Rabb, He's the Master. He's the, my goal in life is to do what He wants. This is my highest ideal. My greatest accomplishment ever can be that I become His slave. That would be the greatest honor I can have. The Messenger of Allah Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam, His greatest honor, Subhan ladhi asra bi abdihi. He becomes Abd of Allah. The slave of Allah is a great honor. That's the goal in life. And Allah pre-programmed that goal inside every single human being. But if you lose sight of that goal, it is like this, you know, you have this uh, thirst, this hunger inside you to fulfill that goal. Allah created you with that. But when your appetite is not filled with healthy food, what do you fill it with? If you don't get the right meal, are you going to say, I'm not going to eat at all? No. When a person is starving and there's no food of their preference, or there's no healthy food, there's even filth, barks of trees, will the human being still start chewing on that when, he's, when it comes to that? They will. When you lose sight of Allah Azza wa Jal, and that no longer is your goal, then necessarily you will find a replacement. Necessarily. It is necessary to have something you aspire towards, that is the mission of your life. The one who has truly really found Allah, their salah is for Allah, their sacrifice is for Allah, their life and their death is now for Allah. The way they live, the way they eat, the way they sleep, what they want to do with their life, their long-term goals, their short-term goals, what are they going to do with their kids, why are they getting an education, where are they going to work, everything is now for Allah, that is their goal. But for the one who doesn't have that goal, they have to find another goal. And in old times, there used to be idols, 
There used to be other religions, you find some other god. But in our times, it's become far more pathetic. Far more pathetic. Now you have someone who's obsessed with their body, and they're working out 18 hours a day. And their only goal in life is to just keep getting buffer and buffer. Keep in shape. Or there's this goal they set with their trainer. I gotta do this many reps, or I gotta do this many push-ups, or I gotta get to bench press this many pounds, etc. That's their goal. That has become their ilah. For a person that their life has become about money. They're, have you met people? They cannot talk about anything except their work. They can't. Yeah, I work at this company, I do this, 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 this. And the moment they lose their job, they become suicidal. Because that's all they ever thought about. That's all they ever did with their life. That becomes their goal. For some people, it's their children. They live for their children. They do everything for their children. Day and night, they think about their children. There is no other thought running in their mind. There is no other goal before them than their children. That is all they run after. When you don't find him, you will find something else. You will find something else, and you will run after it. And you will give your life to it. And this is it. there is no exception among human beings. And today, it could be even a slacker. You could, and you could ask me, what about a slacker? You know those kids that play 20 hours of video games a day and don't get off the couch? Well, what is their goal? It is to entertain themselves. It is to fry their brain cells behind a screen. That is their ultimate goal. That is what they want to reach. And they're, they're working hard to attain it every day. Right? That's what it becomes. These are the psychological implications of understanding Tawheed. It is easy to say Allah is one. But is He one in my life? It is, is, he, is He the one for me? Or do I have some other one that I'm running after? Or some other thing that I put before myself? Allah asked this question rhetorically. He says, مَا غَرَّكَ رَبِّكَ الْكَرِيمُ what deluded you from your gracious master? What was so important to you that you ran after? That you couldn't come after this? SubhanAllah. So when he uses this word, هُوَ اللَّهُ أَحَدْ It's psychological implications. It's implications on our attitude towards Allah. And how we think about our life completely changes. Now there is nothing more important to me than making him happy. Nothing more important to me than him being pleased with me. Nothing more important to me than he forgiving me. Nothing more important to me that he would talk to me on the day of judgment telling me that I'm successful. He will look towards me. I will not be from the ones he turns away from. Allah will not talk to them on the day of judgment. May Allah not make us from those people. What I really wanted to talk to you about is one dua that changed my attitude about a lot of things. And it's something that I, it affected me and it affects I think a lot of people. So I travel and I meet young people and they say, Ustad, I'm studying engineering. I feel really bad. Why do you feel bad? Because I'm studying engineering. It's dunya, you know, I'm studying dunya. Make dua that my parents don't make me study engineering so I can go study deen. Because I, I, want, I don't want dunya, I want deen. Somebody else can say, I have a job. I feel so bad. Why do you feel bad? Because I'm an accountant. Well, okay, then you should feel bad. No, but anyway. <laughs> but they'll say, you know, because all I do is, you know, do, I file the taxes for this company or do the, do the books and this and that. And I, I spend nine hours a day doing that, but I only spend one hour of day reading Quran. Or I only spend a little bit of time in the masjid, but I spend most of my day working. I feel terrible. I'm like, what do you think farmers do? They do a lot more hours than you do. What do you think other people of other like what does Allah want from us to leave our occupations and recite Quran all day? You know, some people have that attitude. If I was only studying Deen all day, then I would be a good person. You know? And if I'm doing other things, then I'm not a good person. If I'm earning a living, I'm running a business, I'm going to college, then I'm not a good person. Subhanallah, this is so off. It's so far from the view Allah paint, the, the picture Allah paints in the Quran. I can't even begin to describe. Why would this book want to keep you inside a library or inside a university or inside a masjid all day and all night when this book is saying, go look at the sky. Go travel in the land. If you want to know the tafsir of go travel in the land, where are you going to get the tafsir of go travel in the land? By going and traveling in the land. Allah wants you to experience life. This is what he tells you in this book. You come back to this book, it pushes you out in the world. Then the world outside pushes you back into the book. Then, you, then it pushes you back in the world. You keep going between the ayat of creation and the ayat of revelation. That's the process of the Qur'an. So one of these ayat that is so epic is the dua of Sulaiman alayhi salam. 
you know, when, when prophets make dua, they make dua for akhirah. They make dua for forgiveness. Yeah? They make dua for their future generations, isn't it? Listen to this dua. Qala rabbi He said, Master, forgive me. Wahabli mulkan and give me the gift of kingdom. La yambaghi li ahadim min ba'di. That is not even appropriate for anyone who comes after me. Innaka antal wahab. You are the one who continuously gives gifts. What is Sulaiman alayhi salam asking for? First thing, forgive me. Second thing, which is what shocked me, I was like, whoa, wh- what? He asked for kingdom. Okay, that's teen or dunya, by the way, by our standards. It sounds like dunya, isn't it? And not just dunya. Don't just give me and give other people. He didn't just say that. He said what? Give me so much and give me something that is not even fitting for anybody else. Make me unique in what you give me. In where? In dunya. How in the world is this appropriate? The beauty of this dua, number one, is his top priority. Ya Rab, forgive me. If you understand, Ya Rab, forgive me, then everything else about this dua will make sense. If you don't understand, Ya Rab, forgive me, you will not understand what the rest of this dua is. A human being can only do so much in this life. The only thing that lives after me is what? It's called sadaqa jariyah, isn't it? Something good you leave behind. The hadith will tell us your sadaqa jariyah could be your money. One of the most beautiful forms of sadaqa jariyah is what? Your children, they do good deeds after you, yes? Now, Dawud, uh, Sulaiman is in a unique position. He has kingdom and he knows how to use it for good. What kind of sadaqa jariyah can he leave behind? Unmatched. He sees an opportunity for to his akhirah to be reconciled by the talent that Allah has given him. Now, what does that mean for you and me? You know, some people, they can't handle fame. Some people can't handle money. Some people can't handle a compliment. So the first thing you have to recognize is what is your weakness and what is your strength. And once you find your strength, then you ask Allah to give you and give you and give you in what you have strength so you can put all of it to the service of Allah's deen. So you can leave a legacy. By the way, how many trees are in Jannah? It's called Jannah, which means it's lush, which means it's filled abundantly, endlessly with trees. How big is Jannah? And how many trees in Jannah are haram? One. And Shaitan can still get you to come to the billions of trees that are the expanse of the skies and the earth. You try to get, get you to go near that one trek. By the way, even getting near the tree must be a trek. And that's why we understand, فَدَلَّهُ مَا بِغُرُوا Shaitan reeled them in using deception. You know what dalla means? Dalu. What's dalu? It's a verb that comes from that. Dalla. To use a bucket to lure people in. In other words, you put a bucket, you put a carrot in it, and the animal smells it, and you pull it in a little more, and you pull it in a little more, and you pull it in a little more, until the animal's trapped. Dalla is also used when you pull a bucket up from a well. Does it come up right away or slowly? Yes? Now if a bucket comes up quickly, adla. Adla. When a bucket comes up slowly, dalla. In other words.